Hello and welcome back to another tutorial video. Today I'm going to show you how to add multiple people to a FaceTime call. So open up the FaceTime app on your iOS device or Mac for that matter. And then once you've done that, what you want to do is you want to create a new FaceTime. Uh, so you have create link where you can share a link for folks to join FaceTime, which you can do that by creating a link. You can get multiple people on a call, but it's much easier to do it this way. So what you want to do is you want to go to new FaceTime. So tap the green new FaceTime button there at the very top and you want to begin adding folks to the call. So I'm going to go ahead and add a person to my FaceTime call. All right, so here we are. We've started the FaceTime call. What you want to do to add someone else or multiple people is you want to tap the I icon. You might barely be able to see it there in the upper right hand corner and it's going to bring up the information about this call. Now, what you can do now is you can go and you should be able to, once the call is connected, you should have the ability to add people. So there's going to be an option there that says add people. You tap on that and then you select the other folks that you want to join the call and you can add multiple people right here from this call. Or on the flip side of that, if you wanted to, when you go to and create the new FaceTime, if you know the folks that you want to add, you can just go in through here and you can select them from your contact list or you can go to the green addition symbol and just type in their phone number if that's something that you might want to do as well. And as you can see here, I've added four different people to this specific FaceTime call. And now when I tap the green FaceTime, it's going to automatically start that call with those four individuals on FaceTime. So go to FaceTime and boom, it's going to try to call all five of them. So that's it. That's how you add multiple people to a FaceTime call. If you have any questions about how to do this, please put that in the comment section down below, and I will see you guys in the next video.